I'm guessing it's that one. That's true. You're not wrong. How I feel about it. Don't we just wander Agreed. over here just a bit? Getting a good talk. Because the way I think it only is going to take four or five of them. You're safe to do it. Mm hmm. We know People they can't shoot. can handle themselves. <laughs> Alrighty. We don't need like a repeat of what happened in Keystone. No, definitely not. Don't want a repeat of that anywhere, I'll be honest. Fucking crawfish. Sooner Stink. these uh, fellas can go down would be the better. That's right. Thank you. We can just get a few of us to meet up someplace private. Figure it all out. Is it uh, what the letter was about? That's what I was going to ask. Mm -hmm. Mm. That's exactly what it was. Alright, I'd be uh, ready to do that. As would I. <laughs> and I did leave one bandishment. Alrighty. I uh, know uh, Catherine has been meaning to talk to you. It's like fucking X-Force. set up a time for uh, when she can get Evan to talk to you. It's like we're fucking the Avengers out here. Is there anyone else you think we should contact? Well, I'm unsure. Already. Rattler's around, so I'd recommend him. He could be of help. Um, besides Rattler, um, uh, I don't maybe know. Jacob. Yeah, if he's feeling up to it. He'd be a good gun to have. Yes, we're going to have good, to yeah. figure out the particular that bounty. Mm -hmm. Do we have yeah. to bring him here? or uh, The bounty is for um, Kate. Fox Bess, I believe? Yeah. Yes. We'd have to do it around a time when she could be awake. Yes. Um, they also left her a with her. lovely note. Saying to take down the bounty in 24 hours and issue an apology. She's not doing it. So. They might uh, well, end up there shortly. Mm hmm. So in 24 hours, how long has it been since that note was left? Uh, well, she got it today. Today. So, so at least sometime, sometime tomorrow. tomorrow. I think maybe we should all just happen to be around Fox Pass. Mm -hmm, if we can. Oh, uh, I know I can be around it to most of the day tomorrow. I probably can as well. Either that or we set up a... If we see players, we meet up at X spot. Mm -hmm. I'll be honest. The problem with these players is that we see them. Right, especially they if they hit during the day one by one. Instead of as a group. And then they just drop one by one. Mm -hmm. If you figure when Sundance was under attack, how many people showed up? Lincoln, Jess, I showed up. There was mm -hmm. some from Cobbs, I believe. Life came with me one time and y'all would have met up together just came in as a group would have gone out a lot better more than likely so yes <sighs> part of fucking already then defense force x over here do you yeah, they're rather gonna, specific yeah. about who you want to be shot in the back yeah yeah got that right Alrighty then. 
I don't see if I can uh, leave a mail in Rattler's box. When do you think you'll be awake tomorrow? Mm, I'm unsure. I can be awake early and all day if needed. I'd prefer to sleep, but... <laughs> um, I think all of us do. I know they do like to hit in the mornings, though Fox Pass's hours are... I don't believe in the mornings. That are normally, I think, um, on and off throughout the whole day. Yeah. What do you think, though? The set of time beat up. What work for you? Um, I can do about any time tomorrow, so. We gotta find a time that would work for most of everyone else. Yeah, I'm likely Shane. I can normally be around right. whenever I need to be. Maybe around noon. In Gunsmoke. Around noon. Two o'clock. Okay, that works. I can do that. <laughs> Like, that'd be what, right at the storm? Yes, that would be the storm on, exactly. Mm-hmm. So right after the right storm. after the storm. Where at? You can always meet it. Stay Fox Pass, because it's central. Just go from there. Sounds good. Okay. And if we see flares, what location do we want to meet at before going in? I did meet up. At the top hat rock, flat top rock, just outside of it, where Dominic right. and them used to live. Oh, that, uh, okay, yes, that table kind of rock angle mm -hmm. and everything. Um, okay. Yeah. Just next to it Far or like up on it? Close enough. Just like right up next to it. Okay. Near the base of it. Okay. Well, we'll walk around it, we'll probably find each other. <laughs> See you gentlemen there. Uh, Alrighty, sounds good. Is that right? I'm going to need to get a rifle off of you. Could probably do a lot more work with a rifle than a and pistol. And then try not to spread the word. Uh, don't we don't worry. need everyone knowing. Don't be spread. Exactly. Well, can't use much can have a word with you. Yes. Do I thought of Oh, uh, they're asleep. I've been watching them for almost two hours now. They're asleep? Yeah. Okay. They ran around, and uh, there's some weird stuff going on I want to talk to Kate about before uh, I tell anybody else. But uh, somebody was going in and out of there that I wouldn't expect to be going in and out of there. Was it Blythe? Yes. I don't know. Because they left her a note, the, that note, and when they went by, her horse was gone, and so is the note. Well, she went in and out of there a few times, even looks like she made herself a volunteer herself as a hostage uh, after they started flying flares up in the sky. Nobody responded to them, and they basically sat there and chatted the entire time. Unfortunately, I don't know about what, I was too far away. But They sealed up the house again, except for the middle window, upper floor, of the main house. Sealed everything else up, and it's been quiet since. And through that window, you can hear somebody <laughs> snoring, you can hear them snoring, so. Well, that is good to know, then, that they're asleep. Um, curious about that whole situation with Blythe, then. Might have to have a talk with her. Yeah, she... She was in and out of there quite often, and uh, they never pulled any firearms on her. Never looked like they threatened her or anything like that. It's like a couple friends having a chat, almost, from what I could see, at least via body language, you know. Interesting. Okay. Well, then, that is good. Okay. Um. But uh, Arthur was 
wearing it. Or he was, uh, his dyed his beard is like a grayish now, I guess. Yeah, so Still looks kind of like Odin. Yes. Oh. Um, he was wearing kind of. He was wearing all black. Oh, he was wearing all black again. He was wearing all black again. At first, he was wearing some strange colors, but uh, uh, he switched to all black. Put on a bandana and a Let's stetson. Let's keep moving down. Morocco was back to wearing his newsboy's little cap, uh, and uh, wearing a kind of like that that shirt with the suspenders that I was wearing earlier. That I took. So he wasn't. So they're back to kind of their normalish attire. But uh, I think somebody else might have been watching them at some point in time. Who do you think? Because they. S they set up a, uh, I didn't see them, but they said, uh, they put up on their sign that whoever was watching from the hills on the, uh, to, to fuck off. There was no way they ever saw me, not, not where I was tucked up, and I wasn't even in the hill, so, somebody else. Hmm, all right. Interesting. So somebody else is keeping an eye on place, but, uh. I'll keep checking back in, see if I see anything, any movement. Okay. I'm trying to get them out away from that house. Right, okay. Well, everybody right now is in, uh, in this meeting. Yeah, I saw the sign down at uh, Serenity. Emily yes. put up, saying where she was going to be, so I figured I'd swing through up here and let everybody know. Right, okay. Well, that is good to know. At least we'll ease up everybody. For now, well, don't let your guard down too much. No, obviously. but you know, <laughs> a little bit better. 